Here it comes, a short fin mako shark. Short fin mako sharks move fast at estimated speeds of more than 35 miles an hour. It is considered the fastest shark known to man. That's quite a feat considering they can grow up to 13 feet long. These incredible sprinters are also excellent long distance swimmers. How do we know this? The Guy Harvey Ocean Foundation, along with the Guy Harvey Research Institute, have tagged more than 40 short fin makos off the coast of the island of Isla Mujeres. One of those tagged went on an unbelievable journey. We call this shark Tough Guy because of his feisty personality. Tough Guy left the waters of the Yucatan to journey to the Cayman Islands. Then he went north around Cuba and through the Bahamas to the waters off North Carolina and Virginia, as far north as Nova Scotia. As you look at these tracks, it's easy to see why tagging sharks is so important. It gives us a better understanding of how the shark uses the open ocean. Protecting sharks and other large pelagic animals is important to anglers. The mako shark is important because it is a highly prized game fish that some people find delicious. 30% of the sharks tagged by the Guy Harvey Research Institute have been killed by humans. Now, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration in the United States has implemented new regulations, declaring the mako shark overfished. Commercial fishermen using open water longline gear must release all live mako sharks and they must retain any dead mako sharks. Recreational fishermen are asked to let makos live. It's one small step on the way to help protect the powerful mako shark. I'm Jessica Harvey for the Guy Harvey Ocean Foundation.